Are you on our time? You have uh, 15 yeah. minutes to send and five minutes for questions. Uh, please repeat again. Uh, may I um, uh, proceed? Ah, you, you are the next presenter. Um, for time. From your work, analysis and comparison of generators yes, yes. of words. Yes, uh, th th that is another talk. Um, it is related to the previous one, uh, but yet um, it covers the uh, problem of uh, of um, co uh, comparing uh, generators and choosing the most optimal one. Um, um, uh, I have argued that certain applications of uh, object generators, both deterministic and random, may be uh, may not require specific distribution. Um, uh, for example, property-based testing requires a generator that eventually covers every test case. Uh, since distribution is not very important, we shall consider other properties according to our goal. Uh, for example, we may want to optimize the time of generating um, a single object uh, or, or test case, this size of uh, this sample generated per second, uh, uh, or uh, diversity of generated sample. Um, we propose a method of comparing generators that can be used to choose the most optimal one for, um, uh, for property-based testing or any other application uh, by formalizing what exactly must be optimized and what the diversity stands for. Uh, we uh, present a language of uh, uh, generator properties uh, that can be uh, measured and compared. Uh, since generating uh, algorithms algorithms are generally parameterized, we consider the problem of choosing parameters that optimize uh, desired properties of parameterized generator, rather than comparing two unrelated uh, generators. Um, the proposed method consists of, consists of three stages. Uh, first, uh, the data about the generator with fixed parameters must be collected. On this stage, we rely on methods of experimental physics, measuring the time and estimating its error uh, for the set of generated objects. Uh, second, the collected data must be analyzed. Uh, since the series of objects can be considered as a sample of some random value, yet with a known distribution, uh, the methods of statistics can be applied to calculate, calculate a set of quantitative properties of the sample. The list of properties is shown um, uh, on the slide. Uh, first, the main performance property is, of course, uh, the time per object generating. Uh, then, uh, any numeric property of objects can be used. For example, um, we applied our method to, um, to our generator of type lambda terms, uh, whose num numeric uh, properties are depth, size, and uh, numbers uh, of uh, steps to its normal form, normal form, if uh, there is any. And finally, the most interesting case is discrete properties, uh, such as uh, the term itself or its normal form, or um, the term with uh, types erased. Um, the entropy of the discrete property can be estimated However, sorry, uh, you are showing us the last presentation. Oh, 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 this, that is, uh, that is not good. And uh, I not, ah, oh, oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Let me uh, start the slides again. Uh, well, I've said that, um, um, well, well, we we have uh, we have uh, some properties uh, to be optimized, um, um, like well, time or diversity or, or uh, other things. And the problem is to 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 uh, formalize what uh, does it mean. Um, uh, the method consists of three stages. Uh, on the first stage, we uh, aimed to, uh, in collecting uh, data. Um, uh, uh, 
Uh, on the sec uh, second stage, we, um, uh, we uh, um, have to analyze uh, this uh, data by measuring um, um, different uh, quantitative properties. Uh, the main one is uh, generation time per object. Uh, uh, do you see the, the correct slide? Um, I'm sorry. Do you uh, see the the uh, slide with uh, quantitative uh, quantitative properties? Yes, we are seeing. Okay, thank you. Uh, the the main uh, the main um, uh, property is the time, but we can use any uh, numerical property. Um, um, we can we can uh, um, calculate the the mean uh, value and the uh, uh, the dispersion. Uh, and uh, also um, the most interesting case is uh, discrete properties. Um, uh, for them, we, we are able to, um, to calculate uh, the uh, estimation of the uh, entropy. Uh, however, um, it requires the large uh, sample of objects uh, to estimate it. And we consider the entropy to be a quantitative value of diversity of the generator. Um, that is, if we want to, to, uh, to make our generator um, uh, more um, uh, produce more um, uh, diverse uh, sample, we have to low, um, uh, lower our uh, entropy. Um, finally, uh, one quantitative property uh, must be chosen to be optimized, uh, which uh, might be a combination of the listed properties, um, of these properties. Uh, two generators with fixed parameters can be compared uh, by that property. One may plot a property depending on one uh, of the parameters and group in series by another one um, for parameterized uh, generator. The example is shown on that slide. Uh, there is a uh, dependency of um, uh, mean time uh, of generation of uh, per, per one uh, object, um, uh, uh, depending on three parameters, um, max size uh, and, uh, um, uh, and uh, um, uh, penalty and uh, Restriction on um, number of uh, retries uh, on each uh, level. The proposed method is um, uh, general. Uh, it does not rely on the semantic of the language uh, and uh, um, thus can be used for analyzing and comparing generators of any language. Uh, our application uh, to the uh, generator of typed lambda calculus is especially interesting because the uh, language is context sensitive and lambda terms uh, have additional uh, computer related characteristics, both numeric and discrete. Um, to sum up, um, we uh, consider the problem of analyzing and comparing generators of complex data objects uh, on the example of lambda calculus, typed lambda calculus. We propose the method uh, that is based on statistical method and methods of experiment, experimental physics, which allow to accurately estimate the uh, error uh, in order to reduce it. Um, the language of uh, quantitative properties uh, is uh, proposed. And finally, we implemented our method in JavaScript to, uh, to choose the parameters of our generator. Um, and apply it for property-based uh, testing of our programs that works uh, that work with lambda terms. That is, uh, with abstract dependencies. Uh, thank you for your attention. Uh, well, uh, please uh, ask me questions. I'd like to answer one. Thank you very much, Igor. I think there is no questions. Okay. Uh, Thank you. Very much.